I really can't quite place this in space and time. Oh. Coming up to the back of a store. Oh yeah. The decrepit sign definitely places this in a limbo-like territory. I think this game actually is a sequel. Or at least a continuity of the same universe. Whatever that means in a game that has basically no narrative. Beyond a weird setting. So there's another one of those trucks. And they're all walking in lockstep, step, so they're all mind-controlled. But one guy's overseeing them. So then the... The big question still is whether those people are trying to help or not. Because kids are inherently, can often be either overly trusting or overly suspicious of all sorts of things, so... It's possible this kid's panicking and everyone's trying- no, never mind. Oh no. Oh no, let's get on that. Solid land. Okay. Well, that was bad news. I was about to say that maybe the kid's panicking and this is all mis misunderstanding, but uh, that dude shot me, so probably not. Unless... Unless we're supposed to interpret all the times I die as hallucinations thought up by his panicked mind. But that's... That's too much extrapolate. That's too much uh, extrapolation that, on things that aren't necessarily evident. That's just creepy. Well, I don't have to worry about them noticing me. They don't seem to behave like people. Let's just get going before someone sees me. That The one in the far back looks like they're wearing a mask, though. That's weird. I thought the people with masks were the ones that were trying to catch me. But it could be that the that uh maybe a mask guy got controlled. I would imagine the masks might be there to cover your face so that you don't get wormed. Alright, back to being alone. At least the rats will keep me company. Not, nope, this is a wall over there. Honestly, the animals seem like better company than most of the other things around here. That didn't work out at all. Can I push this thing off the wall? I don't think I can make that jump. So let's try what I was hoping you could do before. Can I push this ladder? Yes, I can. There we go. I thought about it before, just not this particular spot. I don't think I could last time. I don't think I could behind it before. In the got some hint of light in the back. Giant robot things. At least two bodies, three bodies. I went by the switch bot on purpose, by the way. I'm not missing it. Just, is that like a slinky? I guess it's. I guess it's a fence wire, chicken wire. That's a that's a human body caught in, in a what's probably razor or barbed wire. Oh. I opened it myself. It's not going anywhere though. I'm gonna have to turn things on. What are those in the back? Turrets? Did they kill everyone? There's so many de there's so many bodies in here, I'd almost think that those things killed them. Yeah. That's more or less what I thought would happen when I pressed that. And the bodies are kind of violently moving around. Uh... Ow. Oh my god. Well, that's horrifying. Come to think of it, I should probably get killed by most things on purpose just to see how messed up the visuals are. That's what Limbo is horrifying about, like... How's the spider kill you? Oh, yeah, it it, it, it it impales you on its legs. What'd you, what'd you expect? <laughs> I'm like, well, not that. So now we know why that person was stuck on wire, and this thing seemed to shoot chicken wire... like, torpedoes at you. Some sort of defense system. I wonder. It very much seems like they're trying to fight a human infection of some kind that takes over bodies. And the first trophy I've gotten was called Left Behind. Which would make me think that they're making a Last of Us reference, specifically. That was the name of the DLC, which I still haven't played. Played The Last of Us, never had access to the DLC. Oh, this this go faster, just in case. <laughs> this place is a mess. Oh no! Ho oh, ho ho! Oh 
No. I have been spotted. Oh, I have to pretend to be one of them. Oh my goodness. You can see my character's face reacting when there's a gunshot in the distance. He hears a gunshot, and he looks up because he can't help but react a little bit. Oh. Even those little subtle reactions of, like, trying not to look at the camera. What are they- what are we doing? It sounds like they're walking off cliffs over and over again. Oh, they're jumping. Everyone in the inside the line jumps. Oh, I think it's blinking at me because I'm messing up a little bit. Oh, they're turning around over there. This is creepy. Look at all these guys staring at us. They're studying us. There's even a child. Is this a field trip? This, it's got to end poorly for us. Shit! I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> that's, wow, that's a very abruptly dangerous. Wow. Brutal. He just gets dragged away immediately. This has to end so poorly. I just, I assume they're all walking into something horrible. Like a shredder, or off a cliff. And then I have the panic mode of like, how, like what do I do? Because I can't keep doing what they're doing. Now the camera's leaving me alone. I died at the last, last possible second, huh? Oh, the dog. Is the dog gonna notice me? Those growling sounds are horrible. Uh-oh. Maybe they'll give up on me? They're just suspicious right now? Yeah, calm down, puppy. Right? Is that what's going on here? Oh, I'm screwed. And now I'm dying. Wow. Wow! That's horrible! That's really horrible! <laughs> now what do I do then? I can't... When he puts to... I guess I've just gotta run for it the moment he starts barking at me. Because he, he has to unleash the collar, so I have some time. Fuck you! No, 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 Oh, how are you alive? Let's go, let's go. Let's get out of here. Oh, no, dog's still coming. Dog is still coming. No! Wow. Wow. This game just really doesn't want people to adopt Rottweilers, ever. Or German Shepherd, Rott no, it's a, it's a Rottweiler. Fuck. Aha, psych! <laughs> go, 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 go! Okay, this is freaky. I'm controlling this guy up here. Save me! Actually, can I go over here? I guess I just had to push myself back over. That window's partly open. What's the deal with that? Oh, it's not the same plane. It's on the same axis, so I can't use it. What am I doing right now? This is... okay. An experience would be the thing to call it. Anything to use this guy for? 
Uh, he might be able to, uh... He might be able to pull that up. Oh. He went through the gate. Can he come back? He's still here. Alright. We'll see how that plans out. Let's get out. There we go. Are we gonna see that guy? He's up here now. Can I push? Yep. Sure can. Ah! So, if I press this button, we can keep going. But that creates a problem for me, because now I can't reach... I can't reach the button. So I need something to press this button, so that the switch can be open. Yeah, I'm not surviving that fall. Can I stand on it? I can stand on it, but that wouldn't really help me, would it? Is there really no... Can I not reach it at all? No, not even remotely. Alright. Problem solving time. How do I go about... Oh, put... Duh. Put it over here. Here we go. Oh, don't go that way. There we go. So now I have access to the mind, mind control again. But now this will be open. Problem solving. I li I'll take my puzzles extra morbid, please. Alright. It's like, it's like cubicle office work simulator now. You do all the heavy lifting while somebody else takes credit for everything. Alright. Is there a reason to stop here? Not necessarily. I can use this guy. But then what is the question? Why would I do that? Even if I move, it falls down. Ow. Poor guy. Can I grab this box? I cannot grab that box. Okay. So if I press this button, and I drop my character, can you then, like, climb up the pole? Can you climb? You can't really j jump laterally very well. He's pretty stuck there. Okay, what am I missing here? I can't go down there. I'll fall. I can't grab onto anything nearby. I see. There seems to be chains over there. Ow. Oh, I feel bad. I could probably grab onto one of these guys. If, give, if I'm in the right spot. Wait. What happens if you get in this thing? Oh, wait. I have so many questions now. Oh no. How many layers deep is this gonna go? This is getting into some sort of weird swapper territory. Oh. Oh. When I try to get out, I drop us both. That's a problem. Okay, so I need to I need to get the second one mind control, but then the second guy has to then push it back so that I don't fall to my death when I'm unplugging. Then hop up there. There was a human in a cardboard box. There we go. Then go one layer deeper. So that guy doesn't get mind controlled for some reason by this mind control, but he does get mind controlled by the other one. Not sure where the rules are there. But they might, it might be hard to keep those rules consistent, because it's already... That feels a little ar <clears throat> a little arbitrary. Well, I feel like I'm about to fall into something nasty. Is that a cement pit? I don't know. Maybe I'll just put it... I'll just center him, I guess. Because that might be what needs to happen. What's this going to do? 
Oh my god. Everyone's pushing them back like, oh no! What's happening here? We need to panic. That, guy's, that guy went to the controls. Somebody ran away. Uh oh. I had a better plan out of my head. In my head it worked perfectly. In reality, well, my head's on the floor. But we'll ignore that. Retcon it. Okay, so can I keep it open? Well, it opens this way, so I want to be closer to this side of the door. That fixes the problem, more or less. The little animation of everyone freaking out is kind of amazing. That little detail. What the different characters do in this, in this situation. More water! Hey! It's like a golf cart or a forklift down here. Ooh, what are you? You look important. What did that- Oh, I'm drowned. He drowns fast. That's impressive. That's a great skill to have if you want to not ever be known for your skills. <laughs> All right. I'll look out for that because it seemed awfully important. The red handles tend to do that. First, we have to hit the surface or I'll drown. It's always interesting how, sh how quickly characters drown in video games. Because it never really makes sense. It's just a gameplay mechanic, really. Ratchet and Clank, the video game, the new one in particular, was shockingly fast about that. You you could die underwater in like four seconds. I'm like, why? It's super odd at that point. That air conditioner seems like it's lit in an important manner. I wonder if I'm supposed to like somehow bring it down on top of this pallet. No, we're not going to be able to jump for it. Not quite. Let's take the pallet with us, though. It seems important. It's a platform in a water area. So what can go wrong with that? I'm just waiting for zombie shark to show up, though. It'd ruin my day. Zombie alligator. Sewer gator with anal worms. There we go, that's how you get out. I saw the solution before I ever saw the problem in this case. Oh. Well, I guess I live here now. Hello, spooky button. What's over here? Oh no, the outside of this chamber is water. I'm probably about to open up the water. Oh, I drained the water. I thought I was about to drown this chamber with water. Oh, I fell in. What's that in the- is that a bike? Yeah, there's a bike. A couple of them, maybe. Another button. Oh, gotta fill it back up. Playing in the sewer, ah yeah! What could go wrong with this strategy? Oh, hey. We just need to get up to that. We need a way to get to a chain. Maybe we'll find another pallet over here? Huh? Hatch? It's a way back inside. Huh. It's a way around the fact that the door closes. When, the s when it's flooded. Ow. Pain. My life is pain. So we can't go backwards, because we can't go back up that wall, so we can't go up- we can't go through the hatch we were in before. Can I grab the bike? No. Don't see much of anything to grab, really. I just need to get up there. How about the office? Is there anything? It looks utterly barren. I don't think I'm missing any details here. And I don't have a way to get back up to the hatch, so we'll have to refill this way. So what's the deal here? Is there anything past the hatch? 
seems like a wall. Okay, think about it. What do I need to do here? If I go down there, I just go back to resetting the whole thing again. It's a way of going back. But to proceed, I need to grab that chain, I think, for some reason. Maybe not. Maybe I'm, make Maybe I'm wrong about that much. If I swim down here, we have the door. It's locked. It locks itself whenever the water comes up. Both doors do. I see. Go, 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 go. There we go. That's all I had to do. Not sure why the hatch existed. I guess just if you're not smart enough to try to go down. Oh. Good, bad. Looks like traffic. Either a searchlight or a traffic light. I mean, I mean, in tra uh, light coming from literal traffic, not a traffic light. Um, may have just messed myself up. It being up and down was probably... Nah, I'm not going to be able to reach that window. If I'm using this for something, it's going to be over here. Oh, it's, it'll float. So the chain's still my goal. I just want this to be under the chain because it'll float, and then I can use it as, as a platform. Right here. I gotcha. I'm wondering when the action segment's gonna come that was along the lines of what happened last time. In Limbo, there was a segment where you, you get you get brain wormed and it's just making you it's just making you run forward. So all you have control over is the ability to grab things and and jump, I think. Look at that. There's still trains running with people on them. What state is society in? Does everyone know on site that I should that I'm a problem that needs to be stopped? Because the surveillance hasn't stopped. Should be able to hide under the pipe. Oh, that looks important. Pipe even moves realistically. The angle of the light. Ho oh, ho ho, I thought I was standing in the wrong spot for a moment there. Keep it going. Keep it going. I just want to know why they're after me. If it's anything like Limbo, there probably won't ever be words or any any explanation. So I just get to think about it all the time. Maybe I'm just crazy. Maybe I, maybe they need to take me back for my medication. How would I know? I'm going for it. <laughs> Was this a mistake? Uh oh. Huh? Oh, well, good thing I jumped. That was the right call. So what's... I'm trying to think of what's, what purpose these spotlights serve in society. They're just constantly searching directly underneath the subway. For danger of some kind? Oh, that's a whole train hauling bodies around. And it's kind of macabre because it feels like, oh! Oh, there's a hatch. It's kind of macabre because the whole thing feels like a... the dumb little choo-choo train you'll see at like a children's theme park. But it's full of bodies. Get in! 